with the topic of the fluoroquinones the next drug is norfloxacin that is less potent than ciprofloxacin attained lower concentration in the tissue used in UTI and dysentery the next drug is pefloxacin which is a methyl derivative of the norfloxacin passage in the CSF greater than in the other tissue that means it have the good penetration in the CSF that is a cerebral spinal fluid longer half life to accumulate effective in systemic infection as well ofloxacin is less active than ciprofloxacin against gram negative equally or more potent against gram positive and anaerobes used in chlamydial infection tb leprosy comparable to cipro in therapy of the systemic and the mixed infections levofloxacin active levo isomer of the ofloxacin 100% bioavailability oral bioavailability so it can be administered via oral route used in community acquired pneumonia chronic bronchitis 90% cure rate next generation of the drug that is second the drugs are lomifloxacin moxifloxacin gami and prolifloxacin Lomifloxacin is equal in activity to ciprofloxacin single daily administration is required with a high incidence of the phototoxicity and QT prolongation. Moxifloxacin is the most commonly used antibiotic or the fluoroquinone in the hospital setting. Its activity against the strep pneumonia gram positive including beta lactam and macrolide resistance 1. Anaerobes Pneumonia, bronchitis, sinitis, and otitis media. Gamifloxacin, another broad spectrum fluoroquinone used in community acquired pneumonia and chronic bronchitis exuberation. Prolifloxacin is a product of the eulifloxacin, broad spectrum, and used as same like the gamifloxacin with the addition of UTI. These are the some drugs and the reasons why they banned from the market. Gatifloxacin banned from the market because of the QT prolongation and hypoglycemia. Spar and Timofloxacin is banned from the market because of the fatal arrhythmia and phototoxicity. Timofloxacin banned from the market because of causing immune hemolytic anemia. Trovafloxacin can precipitate out hepatotoxicity. Gripafloxacin cause cardiotoxicity. Clinafloxacin cause phototoxicity. The, these are some brainy questions. You can answer these questions in the comment box. A contraindication to the use of ciprofloxacin is a history of a epilepsy. B. Deep vein thrombosis. C. Gout. And D. G6PD deficiency. Answer your question in the comment box. Which of the following fluoroquinone does not require dose adjustment in a patient with creatinine clearance of less than 50 ml per min? The options are Cipro, Trova, Lomi and Sparafloxacin. Tip points of the fluoroquinones that must be asked in the screening test or interview. And as a pharmacist, you should know about these tip points on your fingertips. Levofloxacin, Moxi, Gami, Gatti and Sparafloxacin have good activity against as pneumonia and also called as respiratory fluoroquinones. They also have good activity against anaerobes. Chronic prostatitis, the drug of the choice is Cipro for 1 to 2 months. Gonorrhea, the drug of the choice is Cipro 500 mg. It having the brand name Ciplet. 